Okay, so this is a video for making goat butter. We've been whipping this uh, butter in the KitchenAid for about uh, 15 minutes, 20 maybe. You want to set your kitchen timer for 30 minutes. If it goes longer than that, then you want to give up on it. But this is already past the whipped cream stage. We're going to mix it a little bit longer. See, it starts to chunk. This is on aged cream that's aged longer than the milk. You date the milk at um, about 14 days is the max you want to do um, from when it was milk. And you want to age it in the refrigerator undisturbed for at least about seven of those days. See, now it forms pea-sized granules. Got the butter in there, separating from the milk. And the mixer is beating it up into larger and larger chunks. About this time, you want to stop it. And... Have your assistant hold the camera. I use my hand. You can use a butter spatula or a spoon, but it's kind of bothersome. And you're just mixing it into a larger and larger ball. It kind of holds to itself. Then you want to pour it, pour off all that milk. That's called buttermilk. That's the original buttermilk. Used to feed that to children. We've got chunks of butter and fun things in there. Now you want to take this, this is your butter, but you want to take it over here to the kitchen sink and you want to rinse it. And you're rinsing as much of the milk out of it as you can because that's what makes it go uh, kind of sour. You just kind of keep rinsing until it's pretty well clear. And that's your butter. Add salt. Add Enjoy. salt to taste. 